Uh, so we have 20 minutes to go through this before the lecture is on start. <laughs> so uh, I asked to just present a little bit about uh, yeah, to you all. We are a state agency designated to analyze criminal justice data statewide uh, to advise the General Assembly and the governor on how the system is working and uh, inform them of what would happen when policies would change. So both legislation, so if we change cannabis thresholds for what's a felony to uh, we raise the felony or lower the felony levels, what happens to the rest of the system and how much will that cost? Um, kind of very important basic questions that haven't been asked before. So what we do is we dig into the data, state criminal justice data to try to answer those questions. And so I kind of feel like we're a useful uh, resource for understanding criminal justice data. And also we can uh, be a resource for any of you who do criminal justice work with open data. Chicago has a great data portal on criminal justice data. When that gets analyzed and put together, we, uh, the SPAC team, there's four of us who, um, two are in Springfield and then Mystic and I are up here in Chicago who do the analysis. So we often condense research and then distribute that information down to our Springfield office, who then go immediately to the governor's office, go to the legislature and share that information fairly quickly. So in some ways, like we are a good public access point to sharing information and research. Um, and we, there's four of us, so we try to be very accessible. So anything that you guys find interesting or think that the legislature should be aware of, that's important for us to know because there's only so much information we can find on our own. So I was hoping to present to you all and kind of share some of our projects as just a way of uh, opening the dialogue between us and you 